we're going to do a video today and uh, it has nothing to do with this tractor. I was just trying to figure out something to do while I made a video. But it's going to do about uh, corruption, politics in, in your area. This is in your area. It's not always it's just in my area. And uh, another thing about our videos is we're going to try to, you know, keep them short. Not to where you're watching a, you know, a two-hour video for a five-minute point that somebody's going to make in their video. So, this corruption, it's not just here in Nicholas County, West Virginia, where I'm from. It's where you're from, too. Uh, the latest thing that had happened to me is uh, I had a building stole off my property. And uh, nobody would do anything about it. Eventually, I did get the uh, state police to come and uh, halfway do something about it. They said if I went to circuit court, they would eventually go back and maybe do something about it. So that's what I got done. But if I would have stole something, I would be sitting in jail right now. And you would be too. It's all who you know in these little towns, especially where I'm from. But what stemmed from me going to the, the state police and the county, which the county wouldn't do anything. And this is where your corruption starts. Somebody tells somebody not to do, do their damn job. But in retaliation of me going and trying to get something done, this guy's girlfriend goes and uh, tells the judge that uh, I took a picture of her car. It wasn't a judge, it was a magistrate. I took a picture of her car and she had a video of me walking around her car, which stemmed into uh, a personal protective order because she's scared. I don't know if that's everywhere, but you just have to be scared nowadays with all the other millennials, Generation Z, or what are all these new generations with all the local bullshit. You don't have to do anything. You just have to be scared, and then you can get uh, one of these put on you. But anyways, we go to court. I pick her whole case apart, prove that she's lying, and uh, nothing's done. You know, just don't go around her for six months. Um, and I'm not a First Amendment auditor. I, you know, I'm not going to go to the, you know, I could go to the courthouse and hold my phone up and, and do this video in front of the courthouse and just to try to, just to try to piss the courthouse off or the, you know, the police officers. I'm not saying all police officers are bad. I'm sure some of them get into it with a good intention of, of doing their job. They just find out that they have higher-ups that won't let them do their job. And then you just have clean-up crooked-ass cops that are just in it because uh, they got a complex because somebody picked on them when they were in school. So they want to go around and throw their authority around. But as for filming, you know, it's done been through, you know, it's a constitution and there's, you know, right, you know, means all, there's tons of videos on YouTube, but just the average person like me and you that's watching this video, you know, you're not, you're not made of money, you know, you can't go buy a lawyer every time a crooked judge does something or, or something, so we got to start standing up for our rights. You, me, the lady, you know, everybody, everybody has to start start standing up for their rights because if you don't, there's going to be pretty soon a time coming that that you ain't going to have any rights left. And then uh, once they're gone, you know, it's all over with the crime. So, but. You know, subscribe to the channel, like it, whatever y'all do, and uh, like I said, I'm 
like I said, I'm just I'm just starting out with this channel. I only have a couple subscribers so far, but we're going to try to build up. And uh, there's another case going on in West Virginia right now. Uh, legally, I'm not allowed to talk about it, but it has to do with, you know, oh my gosh, Nicholas County again, you know, where they screwed up. So there's going to be a big case coming out. If y'all want to see that in the next couple months when legally I'm allowed to start talking about it, I'm really going to throw that out there and tell everybody about, uh, you know, what's going on and just how corrupt the place that you live could be. And it probably is. But that's my video. Thanks for watching.